Hello everyone, this is CJ Novo 982 and today I have a gameplay for you guys to have a look at while I speak a, f a few things about my channel. I'm just going to give you a quick update and tell you what's to come. Uh, tomorrow, I think that will be Friday, yeah Friday, I will be uploading on my journey. Uh, it's playing with the ESPN Cup, FC, uh, I think it's ESPN FC, something like that, it's worth 7.5k. So I'll be taking my sight into that and I'll be showing you my entire footage. Just like I did with the Advanced Cup, uh, which was actually got quite a good uh, review by the subs. They seem to get a lot of likes, so I'll be happy to do that again for you guys. It'll be about 13-14 minutes long, the usual. I have some cracking games. I'll give you a few spoilers. I actually do play a team of 89 rated, so it'll be exciting. And one of the games does go to penalties, but I won't tell you which one. And we make it, I won't actually tell you where we make it to. You'll see tomorrow. If I actually win it or if I just come slightly, slightly less off against the final opponent. <laughs> but yeah, uh, as you can see in the gameplay, it's just a good game I had again last night. Uh, Doing be asked on a goal there, it should have been saved by the goalkeeper. Normally a very reliable goalkeeper, as I've said in my squad builder, but you can't always get, uh, you can't always save everything. But I actually kind of wish I did save that one because this person actually turned out to be a bit of an asshole. You'll see some of the messages. I've cut out some of them because, well, I couldn't exactly fit them into the video because there's some of them, well, most of them are actually very racist remarks. Uh, <laughs> like, uh, kind of crazy, really bad remarks. I've cut out some of them, but I think uh, a couple of them does actually go with the highlights. So I apologise if any of any offend you, but it's FIFA Limit Team. You always get bad losers that like to type things like that up. So once again I do apologise but there's nothing I can do. But yeah, tomorrow's video will be uh, my journey, 13-14 minutes long with ESPN. I've done some new additions to the squad as well. Uh, you'll see that in the gameplay, I may as well just tell you them because I don't think I've done a squad builder to show my new my new players into the side. I have the left back, I cannot say his name, but he's the team of the year addition in the French League side. He plays for, I think it's Montello. Oh, I can't even say his name, but he's left. I'll tell you his stats in a second as it just loads up. Uh, but in the midfield, I have Belhanda. Uh, he's an 80 rated team of the year. Uh, he plays in the French League as well. Very good rated. Uh, I think he's got 4 star, yeah, 4 star weak foot and 4 star skill move. Very fun player to play with. I just, I think I needed something just more in the midfield. Hoofs was good, but I was just needing a bit more pace just to step up because obviously in this cup, you're playing a lot better players. Uh, so you, you can't exactly go on with slightly lower players and expect to win, especially with a tournament of that high rank. So my left midfield, uh, left back player is actually called Bed Bedemo Nessie. I have no idea if I've said that name right, and I deeply apologise if that's wrong, but that's my left back. So 91 pace, 85 defending, and 79 heading. Good player. And my other centre back, I really should have picked somebody with easier names. I think his name is Yanga, Mabaye, Mabaye, yeah that looks about right, 69 pace, 86 rated and 85 heading and 86 defending, sorry. Yeah, and that was the three additions to my side and also I got a new goalkeeper as well just for the tournament. Because I was kind of slacking, especially have you seen a few mistakes done in this game, so against like the Ronaldos and the team of the year uh, message, you definitely need a bit more uh, reliance at the back so I picked up the goalkeeper called Elena or Elena and it's not the hot girl from Vampire Die sadly it's the defender as the goalkeeper that plays in the French League so he's 98 diving, 85 handling, 70 pace, 81 uh, positioning, 88 reflex, I absolutely love that goalkeeper he's so fast and because he's 70 pace that actually really does help the goalkeeper out very good at reflex save so yeah I was just kind of showing you the kind of players telling you about them uh, the three new signings that I've also they don't actually feature in the league because I was wanting to win it with most of my Dutch side but I did buy a few more uh, French league players Gairundi, uh, 88 rated a team of year player and Utaka so yeah they'll be in the squad in a few days time you see a couple of videos with them I'll tell you if they're worth it maybe do a review on Gairundi because it looks like they're really nice stats but yeah tomorrow's video will be uh, my journey with those players as I've mentioned and as this video is just winding down now I'll just end it quickly as we uh, win again on penalties find us undefeated now on the penalties so go team CJ Noble 992 <laughs> so yeah that's it
I've been CJ0192. Thank you for watching and bye-bye.